Hi, I'm attorney Nick Alcock. I'd like to talk a little bit about a case that just got some news in the Supreme Court of the United States of America. It's a case involving Dwayne Buck, and he's been on death row for quite some time. And this case is really astonishing, because in 1997, a prosecutor in Texas had the audacity to call a psychologist to the stand, and that psychologist testified that Mr. Buck was a significantly more dangerous person, and he was more likely to commit future acts of dangerousness because of the color of his skin. And this is just really amazing to me that in 1997 that that is an argument that could be used in a court of law, that a judge would allow that to happen, that the color of his skin would somehow be used against him. Uh, it's just astonishing to me that, that we would even be having this conversation in 2012. Somehow this order, the, the sentencing of his execution, didn't get overturned, or he wasn't allowed really a fair sentencing for years and years and years. And the case went all the way to the Supreme Court, and Mr. Buck was moments away from being executed, and they stayed the execution. Uh, and thankfully, they did so. I'll be following this very closely. I want to see what's going to happen. I just, again, I'm astonished that we're even in a position where this is a discussion. It's so obvious to me that he deserves a new sentencing. I have to think that something has just gone terribly, terribly wrong. In Arizona, I can't imagine a prosecutor, a county attorney, uh, attorney general using that type of argument. I've never seen it occur. And I can't imagine a judge allowing it to occur as well. And it seems like the safeguards here all failed Mr. Buck and failed us, really, all the way up to the very, very last minute. And that's just amazing to me. So I'll be following this. and. Uh, giving you my two cents. I'm very curious to see what's going to be happening. My guess is that he'll get a new sentencing at the end of the day. I hope that's the case because it's so obvious to me that uh, people should be, uh, they should know that if they get in trouble, they get arrested and they are being sentenced, that the color of their skin is completely irrelevant to what kind of sentence they should get. I would just hope that anybody would, would know that, would feel that. It benefits us all to have certainty, 100% unequivocal certainty that who you are and your race has no bearing on what should happen to you in the criminal justice system. So we'll be following it. Thanks so much for watching. Appreciate it.